to the donkey. Welcome back, everybody. Hi. Um, so we we had an interesting Welcome little part three of uh, of Skull five. Games, the finale. We'll uh, probably have like we're... five parts. W Winter <laughs> just died. Um, Gruesomely. Winter just died horribly, and um, uh, Hippo has uh, like turned her attention to the next person on her kill list, which I'll let Blil decide when her turn comes around again. Uh, nice. Doc had arrived, and so now it's up to the top of the order with Parasol, a corpse, and Gran <laughs> Morath. <laughs> um, but I'm going to have you roll again to figure out when the egret goes. The intoxicating uh, aroma. Right. <laughs> uh, good. D ten plus just, Dex uh, plus does the secret have uh, best reaction? No, no, just, yeah, just use the character sheet. Um, meanwhile, yeah, just, though, uh, Morath, what do you do? You just saw someone get chopped in half. Yeah, so you know how yeah. like he's just like. By the way, if shit ever looks like it, it's hit the fan super hard, eat the cookie. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. Well, I, I, I'm debating it real hard, but why? What do you think? Do you think the doctor's gonna poison you? No, I, I, I'm worried that it'll take me out. Actually, no, he wouldn't make it so you'd take me out of the fight by teleporting me away to some in, indeterminate okay. distance. First, I'm in question. I'm questioning. How can you? Why would it, wait? Teleporting cookie? <laughs> Dude, I don't know what kind of magic yeah. he can do. It's reasonable to think. He I mean, was able to poison an entire encampment of soldiers. Okay, with a you small asked pile. him to do that. Don't even. I did. Don't even. So, do. But like, we're talking about the power level of his stuff. That's an power immense level. amount of power. Like, yeah. so fuck hey. it. Yeah, I'll eat the cookie. Do okay. It. Yeah. Zombie. What is the let me here? let me read it out for you. I have it open. Oh, oh my god. god! Are you turning into a big small monster? Please. No. <laughs> this is better in some ways. <laughs> in some. <laughs> in some ways. Ambrosia. This Atlantean substance is passed down through mythology oh, yeah. as the food of the gods. Oh my god! Oh, god. So to make those who ate it immortal. What? Oh. <laughs> Wait, While the claims are not exactly true, ambrosia has tremendous, tremendous curative properties, and when eaten by normal human, it revitalizes and rejuvenates them. And now let me just get to the numbers. A bar or cake of ambrosia, which is what you have, has tremendous healing properties. It restores D10 life points, or endur endurance points. Furthermore, after eating it, normal life or endurance or essence point recoveries are doubled for a period of one hour. This is basically the, um, yeah. the thing. The encounter. Yeah. Uh, and then also uh, eating one bar stops the aging process for a full D6 plus three months. Wow. That's nice. And then it says, I don't understand this. So it stops if it's D6 plus three months. The next sentence is, unfortunately, after a few decades, 10 years per constitution level of the subject, the effects start wearing off. So I'm not uh, sure if it's... I, I think that's um, basically it's like e even if you keep on eating them, uh, like you eventually, like oh. it, it just stops like working, like you can't live forever with it. Yeah. Yeah. No, but my regenerative properties have doubled, and I'm at full health. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Keep in mind, you're finding an enemy that can insta-kill you. Well, not so, quite. But well, not quite yeah. insta-kill, but yeah, very. It very does a lot of damage. Yeah. 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 Well, but damage. yeah, so so what are you going to do though? After um, eating the after bar eating and the like cookie? feeling yourself power up. I'm whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, strong. I'm going to try to get in between uh, the skull girl and uh, and Mabuse. Uh, and they're, they're already connected at the, at the hip, literally. Yeah. They're, well, like, no, 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 they're no. attached. Like, I, I mean, I'm getting in between them and uh, Parasol. Okay. 
Okay. You and uh, um, g- taking a d- defensive stance. Okay, so you're going to basically like get a plus three to all defensive actions uh, when they go after you. Yeah. Okay. Um, so now that goes to Laura. Uh, Parasol is okay. actually going. Parasol goes uh, before you. So Parasol uh, is going to f- fire Krieg again. Nice. Uh, do you want to make a sort of defensive action? Uh, Epo? Epo, yeah. Uh, another defend that. Should okay. soak it. Okay, so in that case, uh, she will take not as much. Uh, 12 damage. Uh, unless you can make a roll to have it. Yeah, she um, she fails that one. Okay, so, so she takes a full 12 damage. Yeah, look at that. The first time that she actually fails a thing. Yeah. That's. Oh, wait. No, combat rolls does not include that. Oh, wait. No, yeah. wait. No. She gets a plus five to and that? The, that's to uh, her like rolls? attacks to. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah. So I was like. Um, so that's 12, right? Yep. Good. Okay, and so now it is Hippo's turn. Hey, herself. kids, you're in second stage. Like, uh, isn't that cool? Hey! Maybe you guys start throwing out our curses now. Oh, God. Yes! Oh, dude, what do you mean she hasn't been charging her curses this entire time? Oh, shit. Okay, fair enough. Hippo. So that's she going two to turns do? of, uh, of yeah, curse. Of, okay. uh, yeah, charging. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, goody. What, what does she do? Um, oh, well, uh, hers involves touch. She requires a touch in order to activate it, right? Yes. So, um, so Doc, you enter the scene, right? Yeah, Doc is um, behind the, uh, the guard, though. Like, uh, currently, um, uh, Mora's character, Fade, is uh, like basically like making a human shield. Is, yeah, uh, okay, is um, Doc right next to Peacock? Or? Yes, yeah, she, he's running to Peacock. Okay. I assume, yes or no? Is he running to her, or is he at her? Um, zombie? Zom- Zambami. Answer the question. Okay, I don't know. Zombie, I'm assuming Zombie is next to Peacock, unless he decided that he actually wanted to go to the body of Renee. But for the time being, we're assuming that it's next to Peacock. All right. Well, then she can't. She can't attack him. Is that? That's a thing. Yeah. Yeah. But oh, goody. Um. So, uh, Graham. More looks like you're next on More the list. Us. More ra- I'm sorry. I don't really follow the same rule. What? I don't fucking care. I don't. I don't know what to say. All right, she's uh, she's been charging for past two turns, and she's doing uh, a a stab at, at you, the stabby sh- stab. Wow, I'm rolling really bad, except I'm still <gasps> doing really well. You, I'm not. You I'm think not rolling you're rolling. Poorly. <laughs> Stop. You think you're rolling bad? You cut me in half. Okay, and I said I'm still what, what doing really what, well. What is yeah. this? <laughs> Okay, so okay. so, what so you, she's gonna just she's gonna stab uh, Morath's character. Okay. Uh, yeah, what she roll? Uh, hold on. She rolled a three, and then she gets a plus stuff. And uh, okay. Morath, your defensive actions are at a plus three because of your uh, defensive stance. She has eighteen in total. All right. Um, I'm going to, to parry. Okay. And to parry. Yeah. It has the added benefit of doing damage to the offending weapon ah. if it succeeds. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> mm-hmm. Okay. And that's a 32. So, yeah, you easily deflect the uh, blade. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But you touched it. Yes, because he's using that's true. his uh, parasite as a. Which as is a all that needs to happen. To activate the curse. Okay, True. So, um, uh, would you, uh, I but think I'm zombie going drone. to roll damage. Yeah, how, how much for... damage do you do to the weapon? Uh, yeah, uh, how much damage do you do? That would be... 
30. 30 damage. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, that's going to send a huge crack running up the, uh, like, larger of the two blades. Nice. So, um, yeah. So, uh, you have to resist against, uh, against the out-of-body, uh, curse. Uh Uh-oh, okay. So that's, uh, willpower? Yeah, hold on. I'm trying to remember her. I have to look at Willpower and iron will. So... Uh, yeah, Iron Will would have an effect here. Yeah, so you get a, uh, yeah, but you have a minus three for it. Yeah, Iron Will adds a plus three, so you're at zero base, and then, uh, plus your, is it difficult or simple willpower roll? Uh, oh, god damn it, I forgot. I didn't write down the difficult. Uh, it's probably difficult. That's usually what it is for these type of curses. Uh, um, what right, do you roll sweet. Uh, damn. curse. Because so, I based it off of the, uh, I have that open. Let me have a look. Oh, oh. shit! Oh, Zombie good. King can help. Whoa. That's a curse or greater curse? Uh, it's the out of body experience. It's like the one that um, that Nero tried to use on uh, the thing. Oh, yeah, yeah, I it's believe it's too, the yeah. same one that you got uh, some of your spells from. Uh, Essence like the, is the force behind all things, including chance. By surrounding a person with negative essence, a vengeful sorcerer may cause the person to experience misfortune. No, no, that, that's, only does no like it's an out of body experience. It's it, like it's under the. Um, it's, a, it's, a, it's not actually a curse, but we're just calling it a curse. But it's it's a different type of spell. Yeah. Oh. Um, hide away, like levitate, used in, locate, uh, sending. It might be sending. Um, I don't think it's, I think it's, it's in the necro- it's in the necromancy tree. Yeah. Oh, okay. You yeah. said that. Because Nero's uh, a necromancer. In the in the base book? Or? I think it's in the base book. I think. Spell spirit. Yeah, I think that might be the one. No, that one's for a loose spirit, not for a person's mm. spirit. It might, be, it. it might be death touch. I think death touch was the name of the spell. That might be Glimpse it. the dead. Uh, Invite spirit. Uh, that's it. Oh, unless it's one of the later levels. Might have been. It was pretty good at that. Well, this is called a, a difficult because I'm pretty sure it's difficult. Like, that's usually the way spells work. They tend not to use simple uh, will rolls. So just yeah. roll a simple, a difficult will roll. So that's just your straight willpower plus a d10. Uh, Mark, all right. Yeah. Uh, gotten 11. Okay, and what's the strength of the uh, curse, Bleal? The strength of the curse? Yeah, like how many essence points do you pump into it? Oh, I, I pumped, uh, I have to, hold on, 12. 12, okay, so that's just a failure. That's, like, just yeah. barely a failure. So the effect of this curse is that for every, um, every three essence points that you pumped into it, uh, that it's basically one turn that you have an out-of-body experience. And, uh, what does the out-of-body experience do? Just... Basically sends your soul out of your body. Okay. Um, sort of like in the same way. Okay, so basically like... That it did with it. He, he's essentially stunned for... Um, for a little bit. Oh, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, okay, yeah, so you had like 12 turns... Uh, sorry, 12 turns. You had uh, four turns. No, 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 no. no, oh, no, no, no. That, was, that, was, that was not 12 turns. No, four turns of essentially stunned. A taste no, of death. Like, Oh, that's probably necromancer the one. can for a brief moment push a person's soul out of his body. Okay, yeah, yeah. What what was the effect of that? Like, like what effect? This being... task uses the necromancer's willpower and necromancy skill. Yeah. Resisted by the target's willpower and constitution. Mm. And willpower and constitution. Yeah, so, so roll will and constitution versus what? Belial, what do you roll for that curse? Uh, I rolled a. I can't remember what I rolled. Okay. Well, roll, roll, fucking roll damn it! I'm having yeah. terrible memory. It's today. okay. Roll willpower plus. Uh, what, what's her necromancy skill? Like what? What's her? Uh, her like what's her? Uh, what does she use to cast her spells? It's channeling. Channeling? No, because no, no, no. Like she what is channels her, what, the curses? No, I know, but, but what what skill does she use? She doesn't have a skill. Is it? There's no skill. That yeah, either is it? No, it, it's a quality. It is it? And it's necromancy. It, okay, what? What are, what are, we're just going to call this the sorcery stuff. Yeah, it's, from which one? So it's arc, it's arcane necromancy. So just call it a six because 
She's this color girl right now. So roll willpower plus six. Fails. There. It's, it doesn't fail. Just tell me what the number is. It does because it's what? 10 in total. That's not a failure. Alright, and uh, um, Morath, what do you roll? Honestly, it comes out because I'm using willpower and constitution. Mm -hmm. um, it comes out as a 20. Okay, so you do resist the curse this turn. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so yeah, so you, you don't curse him this turn, but you can try again by channeling more essence. And the next person on the list is Winter. The Egret stands up weakly. Just he's taken some blow from this. He he uh, he walks over to it, aims a shotgun. Like he's he's a little bit of a distance off. I would say uh, he's like thirty feet off. Okay, and he just shoots. All right, roll attack. Uh. The 10 plus. I gotta get used to this new sheet, so I'm sorry. Oh god, this guy has really bad stats. Jesus. He is a survivor. And he has a 4 in shotgun. 14. Oh wow, he rolled 10. Okay. Uh, and then a 2, so 14. Okay, Hebo, what do you want to do to try and dodge or block? Um, let's dodge this time. Okay, dodging. Uh, roll a d10. Uh, Twelve. Twelve? Okay, that... Wait, uh, plus deck. Oh, say twelve plus uh, dex and uh, dodge. Oh, I forgot to add the dodge skill. <laughs> uh, I was about to be shot. Fifteen. Yeah, so that's okay, a yeah. that's a dodge. That's a dodge. Okay, so then, uh, Doc. Uh, Doc, what are you doing? You've arrived on the scene. You have kind of been in a weird position like you, you, you came in a bit late uh there's already one person <coughs> dead peacock is bleeding out uh hippo and uh fade are locked in combat uh one of the egrets is still up and fighting parasol is still alive what are you going to do oh dear oh dear is um renee still alive no. Like, I know she's cut in half, but did she, is she like... No, she has no, negative her, 128 hit Yeah, her, her spirit left her body. Okay, like but you stuff. haven't... You haven't... I'm, I'm going to spend a drama point. Okay. To make sure Renee's alive for a few more seconds. Okay. So her heart's still pumping out the last of her lifeblood. Doc leans down and he says... I was... Hoping you would do better than this, but truth be told, this is all your fault. <laughs> oh, my God. oh my God, that's so cruel! Oh, that's, what an wow. asshole! I love this. Jesus. Wow. He, he heard the explosion, obviously. Yeah. You ran off without telling us where you were going. You mind, mind the silly words the silly phrasing from my childhood, but you split the party. Get him. You failed at detonating... Renee from the dead. <laughs> yeah, no, like, Renee's just laying there, like, slowly bleeding out while the dog, like, bends down and, like, takes her hand, starts insulting her. And, <laughs> and, like, her and truth be told, like... <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to be able to save everyone in this room before they die. Does Renee say anything? Or oh try to say anything. Oh my God. Renee is choking on her blood. Oh Can I roll? Hold on. What was that? A no, physician. I wanted Renee to. I wanted Renee to be basically motion for him to lean in, and then he leans in really close, and then she says, "Fuck you." 
exactly. Played it really <laughs> in the nicest whisper. Yeah, that would be great. Okay, but no, yeah, like so. So, Brene coughs up a bunch of blood. In response, can I roll a physician to see what sort of state she's in? Sure, roll for it. <laughs> Dude, I don't even have physician. I can tell you, like fatal. it looks like it, it, it looks like a fatal case of dismemberment. It looks like she's in critical condition. I know. I know it looks like it might not be, but it, it looks critical to me. That's a sixteen. I want... Okay. Yeah. So uh, she has suffered massive uh, trauma to a number of her vital organs. Uh, she has a massive laceration going all the way around the circumference of her, uh, you know, uh, her, uh, or the complete diameter of her, uh, tor- her torso, uh, fractured spine, uh, punctured lung, uh, severed intestinal tract, uh, mm-hmm. ruptured stomach, <laughs> uh, massive blood loss. Uh, oh, and her bottoms, uh, on the other side of the room. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How's her skeleton looking? As a uh, whole? Aside from the spine um, and the lower body halves. being gone, it's still mostly there. <laughs> okay. Now, can I roll like a skull girl knowledge to see if I know if her like skeleton's going to start like clawing its way out of her body soon? Oh my you god, can... I would love her legs to start <laughs> standing up. <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> um, so basically, here's the thing: you you don't even have to roll Skull Girl's lore to know that yes, this spooky skeleton that is inside <laughs> this woman is just waiting to get ca- to get out. At least it's not one of those creepy baby skeletons. No, the baby bones luckily <laughs> died with uh, Tan. Oh um, boy, she chokes once again, like. Her, her shoulder kind of moving an inch, but if I like, is she like, is it like a zombie? Nothing. If I smash her skull with the heel of my foot, will oh <laughs> will my not come god, back? Um, you don't know, maybe. <laughs> That's so fucked. Oh god. That's so fucked. Oh, oh god, this is this is really so dumb. Dumb. This is not a monster. You know, when uh, you uh, say that, has been blasted into a wall and is like her arms and legs are both shattered. You, you guys do realize, realize there's a giant Gigan with an abuse attached Currently, in the middle of the room. Yeah, like able to and cast fucking... And you're stopping to have like, a chat with a dying party member who died. That's right. Talking because, the reaction. Because <laughs> she was chopped in half by the giant Gigan with an abuse attached to it. Oh, look, look me in... <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> look me in the eyes, Graham, and say, tell me truthfully that you don't think that this is all Renee's fault. Right. He can't look you in the eyes. <laughs> I can't. I can't. But... You don't know eyes. When I, I, I can't. A, even if I could, by the way, I totally agree. That being said... Oh, <laughs> that being said... She's right. Your threat assessment capabilities are not exactly top notch if you're not engaging the giant Gigan with your magical voodoo witch doctor powers. Hey, Drew like, Hunt. Jared, put the lime in the coconut and shake it all up, for God's sake. <laughs> There's also a dead Marie and a slowly dying uh, peacock in the room still. Yeah. It's fine. It's fine. So, the problem I face now. Right. Is that it costs me one essence point per life point to, like, you know, a surviving level of life points. So, you know, to zero or to one or something yeah. uh, in order to resurrect a person. You could well, not you do want, that. Well, if you want, she could have used her own okay, joke when he had thing. to make the 58. It would take you too long, long, she would have blown out by then. No, I'm not talking about Renee. I'm not going to help Renee. I know. She's yeah. too like you could... P- Peacock just needs stabilization, and Marie can be revived pretty much with anything. Like basically, the yeah, way because that Marie... she got her neck snapped. Can you draw me a floor plan? I want to know like where everyone is. <sighs> okay, let me hold on. Um... <laughs> and while we're doing that, we need to work out how many drama points can we just, everyone. Let's has. just. Wait, how long have we been going? I, God, I've spent know. one, so I have seven. Um, hold on. We'll take a break in a, in a minute. I need. I. I don't think we've 
we, we've gone quite long enough to uh, justify another break well, this quickly. Yeah, we yeah. Um, no. We're probably like in weird positions anyway in terms of like where, where like all the things are. Yeah. yeah. You will need to calm down. I've been sitting here quietly for the last like hour or two waiting for you all to finish your like several turns and conversations. No, and no, I, I, I don't disagree. I'm just trying to figure out like the it, Belial's right in that like the whole floor plan thing, like getting a new floor plan drawn up is going to take we'll just uh, draw like a circle and it's, like, it's gonna take a, a red second. one I'm, represents. I'm, 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 I'm drawing the circle. I'm drawing the whole thing. Just you, you, you people be patient. Okay. Um, I want, I want it to be like the Mona Lisa. Okay. I'll, I'm, I'm drawing the Mona Lisa here. Okay. So there's, <laughs> His throne room. What, what was the line from Jojo? And this might sound a little bit inappropriate, but I got an erection. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no, no. It's like when I saw the Mona Lisa with her arms crossed, uh, what is it, crossed against her lap. I, I, I know this may sound uh, crude, but I got a boner. Yeah. Okay, so this is going to look really fucking ugly, but. Um, we got fade right here. Oh my god! Oh my god! My inability to draw. I'm just gonna use the little the little circle tools, because my inability to draw is 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 really terrible. Um, I'll use this one. <laughs> then I'm gonna. Oh boy, I'm gonna do and draw a little circle for where you two are, and then I'm gonna draw a little sharp. Um, one this is a bit dirty, but I got an erection. Good job. I just cut out the part with her hands and he framed it on his wall. Okay. Okay, perfect. Um, okay, so here, here, we, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Um, so this is basically what the floor plan looks like. And I'll show the people at home, even though I, I promise you, you probably don't even want to see this goddamn image. Um, <laughs> this, is, this is perfect. This is what this I want. So, perfect. So the... Um, once I get it up on screen so that everyone can see it. <clears throat> okay, so the, the red box with the T on it, that's the throne where the dead king is. Uh, the orange squiggly bob is uh, Mabuse slash uh, Hippo. Uh, they should actually be a little bit forward. Uh, like the green blob is Fade. The two of them are now fighting. The body, the blue circle is Marie's body. The purple circle is Peacock's body. The pink circle uh, is Laura and... Uh, P and uh, parasol, and the brown circle is. Um, what the Dog? fuck is the brown circle? I guess. Or Dog. is that uh, the soldier? No, no, no. Is that's that... that's Doc. Um, then basically, everyone who's not represented otherwise is in the pink circle. But like, okay, so that sorry, no, that's the body of Renee. Brown is the body of Renee. Purple's the is uh, uh, peacock. Blue is Marie. Orange is the Skull Girl, and it's actually probably moved up to the green by now because they're fighting in close combat. Okay, so I just need to hit the, the orange. Yeah, the orange needs to go down. The blue, if you want to resurrect Marie, needs to be resurrected sooner rather than later. And the purple is... I get I get one hour per constitution level to resurrect people. Okay, so you probably don't want to... Uh. Yeah... Okay, if I move in front of the green blob, who is the green blob again? Uh, the green blob is, is... Yeah. Who's the blue one then? Marie's body. Oh, okay. So I can't really hit. Uh, and the orange blob is closer to the green. Hip. I can't hit hippodermis without hitting Unless Marie. you went over to a different... Yeah. I want to see one around the entire room. Yeah. Actually, if you went No, up, this is this is I'm talking about this because this is a spell. This is a massive area of effect spell. Okay, like then yeah. 10 by 10 don't. meters. Okay, then yeah, you're going to hit both both Marie's body and uh Emora. All right. I'm going to talk to Hippodermis now. <laughs> Something. Okay, fine. But the, 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 I'll give you like a little bit of talking, but then like your time expires just because I have talking is a total reaction. What you mean? Speaking is a free action. <laughs> there are limits. 
There are um, limits. Okay. Well, so it, 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 this, this is, is the if I'm talking to hypodermis, I could potentially just interrupt combat and like. Okay, I, yeah, I'll let you talk for a little bit longer, but then, like, again, it's going to go up to the top of the order again. Hippodermis. He, he's walking from Rene towards Hippodermis with his, like, fingers crossed. Wait, which one is Hippodermis? Epo. Epo. I just Ipo. missed calls her name because he's an asshole. But, um, <laughs> yeah. Uh, she draws her attention from the un... like, the, the soulless... Whatever, of uh, of fame, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> and um, and draws her what, attention towards yeah, what, him. What what what, do, what does Doc do? Why are you doing this? Someone asked the very same question. I wasn't here. Stay dead, Renee. Jesus Christ. Are you actually asking that? I am. She, uh, she steps away from, from the, uh, from, from uh, Fade, and towards Doc. You of everyone should know. What did I ever do wrong, to you, Hippodermis? <laughs> What did I ever do wrong to you? Epo walks closer <laughs> with a very annoyed look on her face. And Doc takes like a step back and holds his hands out like, you know, palms open. It's sort of defensively. Not not a massive step back. He's not like mm -hmm. retreating. He's just like, calm down, yeah. calm down. Perhaps Epidermis you want to destroy the city, don't you? Yes. And you have something I want. Abuse. Why? When? What do you mean? Now, I would like to make a agreement with you, just temporary. Remember when we first met? Uh, Ipo, while they're, while they're, while he's doing this speech, is slowly, like, step by step towards him. Remember when we arm wrestled for your ownership? Remember when it was a draw? How about we settle that once and for all? The doctor oh holds out a hand. Oh my god. <laughs> Parasol just stares at both of you in horror. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> Even the e is, is right in... now? How close is he right now? Uh, April. Pretty close, pretty close. Like the two of them are getting close to each other. Even you can If I lose. You'll be able to kill everyone in this room. But if I win, you leave this city, and I take Mebius. Oh, no, okay, no, actually, I take that back. You don't leave the city. You leave this room and everyone as, the, as they are. For now. Uh, Mebius whispers into uh, Hippo's uh, ear, Do it. I have, uh, yeah, I'll take care of the old man. Uh, uh. I'm just gonna really quick roll a willpower roll. Okay. She's still. You can really use Renee's body as a table, <laughs> even. <laughs> yes. Oh my Where, god. She can make a bone table. What are you talking about? Yeah. Yeah. She's yeah, like just just like table. manipulate the bones to like All jump right. up. So. uh... Got a nine. All right. Uh, you can decide how you want to do it. Nine is a success. Let's cinematically just exempt. Okay. <laughs> so like, yeah, okay. he, he both, like raises up a hand, and suddenly this like bones rip out of like the uh, the floor, 
and like yeah, cruel. like um the table legs are are um are Renee's legs that stand up and yes. run over underneath. Uh, <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, no. Like like Renee's body like crawls over to like set up like the legs, and then the king's body like creaks and like jerks over to like fall into places at the tabletop. <laughs> And uh, like as you uh, as you move to the table, dog, like Mabusa's shadow like rolls out under your feet, uh, like surrounding you in darkness. And uh, like as as you uh, like kind of sit down on a table made of the bones of the egrets who uh, came in here with you, uh, his voice hisses in your ear. I'm going to enjoy finishing you, Doctor. Okay. Um, <clears throat> Hold on, I just gotta roll something. Arm wrestle. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Hold on a second. I'm going to uh, just stretch for just a moment. Good thing I bought oh. the arm wrestling skill. No, I'm... <laughs> 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 oh, God. That would have been funny as shit. I'm going to add eight drama points to this. No, you will <laughs> add on. one drama point to it, to any given. Is this uh, considered a uh, combat role? Uh, yeah, yeah, we, yeah. Because especially because this oh, is against yes. Dawn specifically, your righteous fury like empowers Hebo's arm. It's Good. like it like bunches up with muscles. <laughs> oh. Okay. Um, it's bone muscles. This is. But bone muscles. <clears throat> so, uh, just a reminder for everyone: the Doctor is very frail, very small, very yes. weak. Yeah, He's but one last strength. time he last time he almost won yeah. because uh, he used a luck potion. Yeah. This time, I, I'm going to say, since uh, you know he he entered the room, he hasn't had a potion to drink. And uh, I mean, I haven't said anything about him drinking a potion before. That. You better have a goddamn plan. <laughs> No, I just wanted to arm wrestle. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord, yeah. Peacock's like eyes are like, like, just like her teeth are clenched as her like father as you prepare to arm wrestle in her dad's fucking body. I was. Um, um, the egret is glaring parasol, through his right? yeah, parasol, parasol, I mean. Because I was like, Peacock's teeth are probably yeah. smashed. Yeah, no, they got <laughs> smashed when they hit the, the rocks. Yeah, they, they might need some replacements. Yeah, she's going to need some sort of So where are we standing right now? You're sitting at the table. Um, at, on the, a, at the throne? Or no, no, no. Like, like, um, just like in, like in front of the throne. Is it the near corpses. Renee's body? Uh, yeah, yeah. No, she is the table. Yeah, she's part of the table. But where is <laughs> made of the bodies of uh, Renee. Okay, well, look, I just... Everybody, sense. please stand back. As I'm preparing, I, like, ask them all to. And move move the bodies away. Oh. No. The bodies are the uh, are the table. <clears throat> no, no, I mean the other bodies. Like, right. um, like move Patricia away and... Oh, no, yeah. she's already in a wall. Yeah, Who's well, Marie's like, body? She's not dead. She's not... What, Marie's body, body is nearby, you both. Okay, well, I asked him to move them away. This is going to be like an explosive arm wrestling match. Okay, fine. The Egret so, picks um, up Murray's body and yeah, just and Parasol drags grabs her. the grabs like Patricia and is just like, Doctor, you like this better be more than just a simple game, or else there will you will have hell to pay for this. I'm yeah. sorry, Parasol. She looks away and just carries off Marie in her arms, surprisingly gently. Oh, in in, in the other hand okay. that Eco has, she has the other um, blade still in it, just yeah. in case. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> the dog, like, puts one hand like on the, on the, you know, like as a counterbalance sort of thing. And the yeah. other hand, obviously, in an arm wrestling position. I can't believe this is fucking happening. Yeah, Holy it's shit! The rematch. <laughs> I I make eye contact with Faye one last time, and I I wink. I give him a point at him with my He's finger. He's unconscious. Yeah. Oh, Faye. Yeah. No, 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 Faye's the one who drank no, the uh, life potion. He's super conscious. Mm. Yeah. 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 Faye is fine. Yeah. Faye is on no, top of the world, actually. Oh yeah. Never mind. Yeah. Sorry. The curse failed. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Well, the curse yeah. in fact. Right, let's, let's roll this. Oh, what yeah. do we roll for an arm wrestle? I can't remember. 
uh, this is going to be a strength v strength competition. Uh, like yeah, Mabuse basically like like rolls up over like the top of you. And it's like this is a. Strength. Do I get to double a, my like... one strength? <laughs> yeah, you can double your one strength. And then like, you feel like the cold. Do you want to double Mabuse, your like... strength because she gets to double hers? Then yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You can. This is a simple strength test on both your parts. And yeah, like Mabuse's hands like roll over your shoulders. Like his weird little head like bends around you. It's like, go on, Doc, make us proud. <laughs> okay. This line isn't going to make any sense. <laughs> Fuck. Um. Fuck <laughs> me. It's so cringy. Are you going to go over <laughs> the top? Yeah. What are you What's doing? a plague doctor without a plague? <laughs> <laughs> As he looks at oh the Oh my god. Oh. Are you going <laughs> back the blank dead? Yeah, like, Mabuse <laughs> stares at you and is like, I am going to enjoy killing you more than anyone I have ever met. Besides, you know. Yeah. No, just like in this I moment, see. he's like, my god. Like, you are terrible. I'm going to enjoy oh, this. Geez. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Hype. Anyway, so we're rolling. Yeah. So you, like, you slam your hands uh, yeah. together. To begin this test uh, of strength. As this is happening, I'm trying to uh, use first aid on Peacock. Okay, roll, roll me that first. Just to, roll, roll me that first. Yeah. We don't want to interrupt the dramatic. God, thing. we're hyping. We're hyping. We're it. hyping up this. Uh, uh, Seventeen. Okay, she's stabilized. She's stabilized. Okay. Uh, she recovers a couple of hit points as well. But yeah, okay. So these two massive, like this massive Gigan skeleton hand and this tiny frail human hand slam together as. Uh, yeah, like to to begin the arm wrestle. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, why you roll? Begin. Oh wow, that was a pretty decent roll. I rolled a ten actually. So oh wow. Oh, that's a total. That's twelve. And now let me roll another again. <laughs> and then I rolled a one. Okay, so that's twelve uh, versus. 12. Hold on. Twelve versus a good base thing I of used 12. a drama point for this. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Uh, thirty four. Oh my god. Um so so first of all, roll damage. Um uh Bleal, roll. Actually, what is I'm, that? I'm for I'm rolling damage. for her now, so never mind, I'll I'll yeah. take care of it. But yeah. So she like basically grabs Doc's hand and slams it so hard into the uh like other side of the table that it actually like she has them. martial arts, by the way. So if you want to, so yeah, I'll add the martial arts. If you want to add the success oh, yeah. levels of thirty-four to that, oh my god, Doc's okay, hand so. is fucking 30. smashed. So it's yeah, so, thir- so, 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 so thirty-four. What's the success levels on that? Um, let's see. Let me uh, check. I I'm so glad I have a JoJo character sheet yeah, that have it easier. All of this. Break down, break down. Over break down, ten. Down. It's probably oh, well. eleven. <laughs> Yeah, no, no, it is a 10. It is a 10. It's a yeah, bonus it's... of 10, so that's a bonus yeah, of 10 so that's, damage. That's before the multiplier, so that is 4 yeah. times a strength of... Let me look at your, 12. Is, yeah, strength 12. And uh, so that's plus 10 before that, so that's a 14 times 12 damage. Let me just find a calculator. Um, That's 168. 168 damage as as Doc's arm is ripped from his shoulder onto the uh, onto I'm the I'm gonna table. spend some drama points to halve that a few times. Okay, but well, you can only spend one uh, drama point. You can only do it per turn. Like yeah. so oh, you can no, only have it, says, it per turn. It says you can do multiple. No, you can, you do one per roll, uh, or does it specifically say multiple for? Uh, it says if you like add it up, if you add like uh, okay, or you get like one eighth damage. Okay, okay, fair enough. Then. So yeah, you you can. I'll, I'll check it again just in case, but just for now, I'll just say one okay. eighth damage. Yeah, that sounds broken as hell. Well, it's I, I wouldn't be surprised if it's like just for a single attack that you can like basically like burn out a shitload Jesus. of draw points. Your really arm because at arm. that point, Renee could have survived. Yeah. Well, so what was the damage? Sorry. Uh, the damage was... That's 168. 168. Oh, wait. Oh, plus the... Uh, pl- wait, is it plus a 10 or is it... No, no, no. They, 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 I already okay. added the 10 into the multiplication. Oh, okay. Good. Yeah. 1 over 8. That's 21 damage. Okay. How many draw points did you spend? 4. Okay. And how many did you have in total? No. Wait, hold on. Because you spent One, 3 already. Half, quarter... 
Oh, no, I spent three. Excuse me. Okay, so you've spent six out of your... How many did you start with? Eight? Eight. Okay, so you have two drops. I spent three. I've got... Good, good, no, you spent a couple ones. already. Or you spent two no, already, at least. Yeah, you spent one... No, uh, I didn't. What did I spend them on? You spent one on the uh, on the thing. You said you were going to use a drama point to... Uh... No, no, I didn't. I was joking. I was joking oh, okay. about, like... Okay. Gonna, uh, for, I was talking about the um, okay. the okay. arm wrestling role, and I was joking. So. Okay, okay. Okay. You were serious. Um, okay, well, fair enough. Um, so Dog's you, health is only, so like... You, yeah, your arm still breaks, but so it isn't he's, he's literally... Yeah, so... So yeah, your arm still breaks, it just doesn't get ripped completely off of your shoulder. But it does still smash mm. like hard enough into the table to leave an indent as your hand shatters. Uh, my reasoning for this is that his arm, you know, he, he's it's not his whole body. So, you know, it's not like ripping his spine out. That's why yeah. it's not killing him, it's just breaking his arm. So right. that's why I don't need to make sense. Okay, uh, and now the spell activates. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering had... why you bothered, you know, reducing uh, the damage at all. But... That would have been funny if you died. <laughs> well, no, the spell, the spell. What I did no. was I had the potion, the tiny like, little even vial. If it, it, like, imagine if it did max damage and it uh, and it killed you regardless. Yeah. Well, well you... hold on. Let's see how much damage this spell does. Yeah. So basically, what so happens is, is uh... the, the the vial he had tucked away in his hand during the arm wrestling match when smashed against the thing hard enough shatters and explodes 1d6 <laughs> times 60 roll it oh shit <laughs> <laughs> wow That'd be quite i told you that alchemy was yeah. broken it can be very <laughs> yeah. this was like why he didn't have any other like potions with the her. thing it won't you, that's you 360 mind. damage all right she's yeah. gonna use the remainder of her drama points, points to, to uh have to get rid of this. and uh yeah so um she will use, how many drum points does she have? Yeah, how many points um, does she bring? She has uh, three. So, yeah, she'll use three to have that, quarter it, eighth it. Eighth it. So, what, what, what number was that again? I can just look at the calculator. 360. 40 HP. So, 360, yeah, divide by eight. It's 45. 45 damage. Yeah. 320 divided by eight is 40. Sacrifice right. himself? Yes. Oh yeah, no. Doc, Doc does not have enough health points left to survive that, even with like. Oh no! I'll just use my drama points. Wait, how many, <laughs> how many draw points do you have remaining? I have. Okay, then self damage. Keep in mind, uh, you just did self damage. I have five left. Five okay. left. What? My reasoning for this is that Doctor cast a, a fire protection spell. Fuck off. Because this is a massive fiery explosion. Okay, so you reduce it by how much? How many raw points are you going to spend to reduce this? Because you can't take 45 damage. Like, you'd need to reduce that by another two. So you need to spend all of your drama points. Yes. Yeah, so right. you could have a all chance. Right. So, so you remove all of your drama points. What is, points. What is 1 16th of 360? Well, hold on. Because it, it's divided two more times. So basically, it goes from 45 to 22 to 11. To eleven. Yeah, because basically you're you're having the damage each time. So you die. <laughs> no, it's easier negative. No, he's unconscious. Yeah. Yeah. So you're in negative hit points, okay. but you're not dead. You're in negative three. It's a roll of consciousness roll. Yeah. Yeah, it's easy. Plus. So, um, so it's minus three. Keep going. I'll I'll okay, roll yeah, my. So, so yeah, like Doc kind of like is blasted back and like lands on the like, gore, like ground, like you laughing and coughing. Her fucking and, arm. Yeah, knocked you down. Her arm. Yeah, he, Hippo is staggered as she like like as her arm like blows to pieces and starts like reform on her uh, like around her uh, hand. So yeah. like without the weapon. We're both on fire as well. Oh, you, oh, you're both on fire. Okay, so you're yeah. gonna burn to death. But yeah, okay, so she's gonna burn come her turn again. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, and Doc is almost certainly. Isn't she dead. already on fire? <laughs> oh, shit. schoolgirl magic. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, well, here's, here's proper fire. So um, now it's Winter's turn. Jesus. The the grid is just going to actually well, that was uh, that was Doc uh, doing the whole Rarmal same thing so actually it's up to Parasol and Morath. Never mind, uh, Morath. What do you do? Um, are the weapons destroyed? No. Okay. 
She she put the weapons down in order to have this fight. No, she has one. Oh, yeah, I told she, you she that the, she, she had one she... in her uh, other arm that she wasn't yeah, using. Yeah, yeah. She, she, Which one has... did she keep? The long sword or the great sword? She, she put down the damaged great sword, so only the uh, undamaged broadsword was in her hand because it's in her offhand. Or touching that she's ambidextrous, but. Yeah. Yeah, the great sword's harder to carry around, so she's probably using it in her uh, right arm. So. Did that destroy that one? No, because no. she put it down and like had it away. It like damaged the broadsword. No, 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 no. But... the other one. No, it didn't damage. The, it no, didn't, it didn't, like... didn't damage any of them. Because yeah, it, it she basically was using a weapon in her hand to smash it. Yeah, down. The, the, the the damage was yeah. localized to the point where it basically blew off her arm that wasn't holding a, a weapon. Yeah. All right. Um. Well, because um. Seeing the opportunity of um. The fact that the skull girl is separated from the giant greatsword with the giant crack running through it. Uh, that's it. What, what do you mean? Like, use I was, it? I was gonna. No, I was. It's like the Bazuzu fight. Or whatever yeah. the fuck his name is. Yeah. You know. Yeah, only yeah. reason he survived is because you cracked the weapon. Yes. Uh, uh, no, I'm gonna, I, I'm, I'm gonna straight up sunder the motherfucker. All right, you're going to try and sunder the the sword. Yeah. Okay. Um, she's going to take an attack of opportunity as you try and like take a like dive past her to attack her weapon. I right, you roll that. You uh, roll uh, your dodge as you if you effectively dodge the attack, you will uh, uh, get straight past her and be able to uh, hit the weapon. Um, Are you still in no, defense? I, I, I think you misunderstand. I don't have to be close to it to do it. Oh, you're going to throw your thing at it? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so yeah, go go yeah. for it. So she's going to instead just try and block the uh, spear. Yeah, so using a javelin attack to do it. Oh, yeah. uh, uh, 31. 31. Uh, so you actually, uh, yeah, like, so basically, like, uh, she tries to block it, doesn't succeed. Uh, how much damage do you do with that attack? All right, let me roll. All right, 40. Uh, 40. Okay, yeah, so you, uh, crack the, so the great sword shatters as it, uh, is, uh, you know, hit with a second attack. Okay. Now that that spear is running back, and then I'm rearmed because of the auto spawning of the spears. Um, okay. All right, and that's what I'm going to do. Okay, so that's your entire turn. Um, so then over to Parasol, uh, who is going to basically like at this point, like she's uh, retreating back with uh, the, both the uh, bodies of the kids. Um, and uh, is going to get them out of harm's way before she continues the fight. So we go down to Laura. What does Laura do? Uh, so Laura shouts as loud as she can to uh, to Epo in right. the room. Hey. Yeah, she she like turns and looks at you. He's, yeah, she's like, uh, why don't we uh, talk face to face? And um, in fact. Lara's actually going to dis uh, take off her uh, her arm. Yeah, she she yeah. looks at you and like uh. then looks at her stump, mm -hmm. and then looks and, uh, to the Laura. Yeah, and she uh, Laura's gonna walk as closely as she can to Epo. Yeah, as she gets close I, enough, um, like Epo holds out the blade to like her throat and's like, you know, okay, that's enough. You can talk for me. All right, Epo. I understand how um how you feel. I uh, sort of um the world going against you. The uh, everyone seeming to uh, give you a bad rap is the same sort of uh, cycle of uh, destruction that uh, has, at least from what I've seen, brought about uh, every single uh, skull girl. Friends, like 
You can't. You don't know what it's like being me. Don't pretend. Oh. Oh. I know, but I had to raise that. <laughs> uh, a bunch of uh, orphans in a uh, trench coat while I was the uh, the drunk that uh, raised them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I understand what uh, behaviors uh, perpetuate that. So, um, I didn't expect to live uh, during this, uh, this sort of, this fight, right? Not really expect most of you to make it this far either. Yeah. And even with, um, Marie, she says with like a million quotation marks yeah. uh, in, in her thing, being attached to you and uh, telling you some things. Um, I know that uh, there is still good inside of you. She's just like, nah, look. No. Me- no, it's fine. Go. She, she actually looks at you in surprise and then looks up at the rest of the people like, wait, you serious? <laughs> like, like what? Like, like she like looks like around like, like you want, you're saying I can just walk out of here. What do you mean? You, you could walk out here at any time. Yeah, I you mean, know? like, you people aren't going to follow me. You're not going to carry this on. I don't have to kill all of you uh, in order to... Look, look, I I want to whisper something to you, all right? Whisper my reasoning to you, all right? Just come up, come, uh, come here, all right? right? She, she, she like leans in. Down, yeah. she, come you're on, a cunt, right? hippodermis! Shut up. Right? No, you're not unconscious. It doesn't fucking matter. I'm uh, unconscious. I, I don't it. care. You're, you're probably Dog still pain. shouts it. Yeah. I want to ruin this. And no, have no, he, he like calls Free out, shot. like, yeah. but no, like, so so hippodermis. No. God, fucking dead. Hippo <laughs> bends down. <laughs> bends down. I want I want her ear as close to yeah. to Laura's mouth as possible, and she uh, and then she says, "Say hi to Tan." And then uh, she's going to pull the trigger on her explosive bomb vest. Okay. <laughs> Point oh, blank into her face. Okay, uh, yeah. Roll that down. Uh, you said it was like six defensive grenades or whatever the fuck it was. Yeah, it was, I said it was so, three, three defensive grenades at the same time. Oh, yeah. I don't I'll, I'll, know the I'll damage get the, of the defensive grenades on hand. So it's... Nice. Um, uh, D, so each defensive grenade is D6 times 10. So roll three d6s. Okay. Uh, I have to remember what a d6... Oh, yeah. It, six it dice. Dies. Wow. Three d6 times yep. ten. Yeah. Right point blank in the face. Okay. Wow, I rolled really well. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. So all the three d6 first, right? All the... They're just, just add them all together and then put a zero at the end. 130 damage. That brings her down to negative uh, 90. Yes! So She's in skull form. <laughs> yeah, so basically, like, you blast away, uh, like, her entire head and upper torso. And you take the same damage, so She's Laura dead. yeah, is gone. Like, she is destroyed. Um, and Kipo, yeah. like... Her like kneeling body just like stays there, but her upper body is just like now basically the floating skull heart, and like surrounding yeah. the skull heart is the wispy shadow form of Mabuse. Oh, yeah, like yeah. you have Mabuse, and he's basically going, "No, who is? Um, yeah, um, whoever who is still alive? Um, I am the character. Fade is. I am." In my second form, but uh, I, no. I don't want to take it. Yes. No, I can't take it. So, um, so. zombie is burning to death. Yeah, zombie is on fire. <laughs> don't kill himself. 
was it? Yeah, One. Um, in a th- five within three seconds. What well, what what happens? Fine. Would you like to go first, Gray? Oh, hold on, wait, wait, uh, uh, zombie. What, what 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 do you do? Oh, Doc heals himself back to full within three seconds. How? He has magic. Yeah, but he already used. Remember, he <laughs> used all of his magic on the. Yeah, but that's uh, not how the alchemy works. This is why I tried to talk to you about it and wait. say that I would just settle for casting spells in place of actually brewing oh, potions. No, because no, because the, you have to have a potion to actually use the alchemy. No, I don't. Yes, because I, I have to. I have to learn the spell in order to actually brew it into a potion. Right, did, but you don't you, have any. How did you brew magic spells? You said you only had one potion on you. Yeah, I did. I don't. I'm not brewing a potion. I'm just casting the spell. But, no, we, we 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 agreed that it was going to be like just you had to use a potion in order to cast a spell. Like that was how <laughs> it was going to be balanced. No, we agreed that it was going to be. We agreed a number of things. And yeah, we kept but, changing. but like the, the thing was like we were supposed to be potions. Like that, that's why I asked you if you wanted any more potions except for just the two, like the the healing one and this one. So no, you last you session it was that he would cast spells. He would cast spells, and I would just fluff them so that Did, they were yeah. potions. Yeah, but but here's the thing. But either way, you just use all your essence, so you can't cast any more no, spells. Because I, I with, and you're with alchemy, you brew the essence into the. No, no, because potion. no, because like we're no, because we're either doing it the way where you run out of potions and then you can't ca- like use any more spells, or we're doing it the way where you have to use your essence in order to cast spells that we're fluffing as potions. Either way, you're out of potions and essence. All right, then I just roll. I roll. Uh, what's it called? Medicine. Doc, Physici- Doc is gonna be fine shortly. But. Um, but yeah, so um, Fade is the only living PC. Dunk is gonna on, be on fine fire. as he is like yeah. shriveled with his broken arm, like on this table, burning alive. Like, <laughs> yeah. He's going so, to be fine. Don't worry. Um, well, no, he'll be in pain, and it, but he can't get any uglier. Uh, he can. Uh, he can just die from the immolation, though. Like, yeah. Yeah, but I'm gonna put him out in a second. I have well, to destroy. You, you have basically destroy one turn to, to put him out. Yeah. I had to destroy the skull heart first, though. Okay. So I'm doing that. <laughs> no! The dot cries out. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna get up close essentially, to um, save me first, and I'll explain. I have a plan. I don't care what your plan is. The skull heart is dying today. You're going to bury <laughs> it somewhere where no one will find it. <laughs> That's the problem. It wants to be found. So, yeah, he's, he's going to throw a spear through found. the skull heart as he's walking over to Doc. Okay, the, the, the heart shatters and explodes. Can I heal the skull heart? <laughs> no, you can't. It's gone. It's gone forever. Yeah, like the, um, Link, uh, Link, 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 uh, really quickly... Uh, like jumps out of the corpse and yeah. starts jumping around the ground, but no. like he starts shrinking. Yeah. No, like yeah. More, yeah. He starts shrinking at. Wait, how far point. away is Mbuse from Doc? He's in. He like jumped right out of the corpse of Epo, and then he's yeah. like dying. He's yeah. dead. Okay, but how he's far dying. away? Is he, he, he's he's too far from you to. Uh, yeah. Yeah. He, he basically, what happens? So, like, it, it's weird though. What happens is like, as the skull heart explodes and starts to suck, like implode in on itself. Uh, Mabuse is like sucked into that vortex and vanishes. Are you saying that he might become a part of every skull girl from then on? Possibly. Wow. Yeah. Oh, but God. <laughs> I'm putting out. I'm putting out the fire. <laughs> okay. R- roll. Roll medicine. Plus additions. Actually, first, doc, uh, roll me a survival first test. You take three points I, of damage. I, I just have. Yeah. For, first, doc, take three points of damage and roll me a survival test. Uh, so it's okay. That's negative six. So I just roll a. No, no. This is um, uh, minus. Um, uh, for consciousness, you'd normally be rolling. This is just to see if you survive. So roll a uh, at a negative three now because you're at uh, yeah you're. No, I'm if... at negative six. No, 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 no. You, you're minus one because you're you're negative six for consciousness survival tests for life okay. dying survival tests. It's. Minus one for every ten points below zero, minus one for each turn you've been uh, out for. So this is. But I'm not. I'm not below negative ten. Um, yeah, but, but you're, you've already been down for one turn in negative. So you take a minus one. So just survival test, constitution plus willpower plus five. You have hard to kill. 
minus one. Uh, plus six. Fourteen. That'll do. Yeah, you're, you're still alive. Um, Morath. Uh, you, you just put him out and heal him. Like, basically, there's no more enemies left. Yeah. There's, yeah. No more threat. So, but as far as the first aid rule after I've put him out, because putting him out is actually kind of easy. Yeah, I'm, fun, I'm basically just going to let fact, you... kids. The Black uh, Tuesday is still around because yeah. you removed her arm before blowing yourself up. It's true. The yeah. Black Tuesday is still... After the fire is out, the doctor nibbles on his second immortality cookie. God damn it. <laughs> and then he, he... Remember he made two. Oh, yeah. yeah. Stands back so... up and he says, Well, gee willikers, looks like I'm going to have to wait another seven years. <laughs> <laughs> to do what exactly? <laughs> to get Mabuse. To get the Skull Heart. To destroy them forever. It was the plan that my wife and I came up with. Hmm. I'll help you out when that time comes, Doc. But let However... me compliment you, Fade, on your. <clears throat> you are an excellent bullet sponge, let me tell you. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Why, thank you. The like, the like, oh god! Is this like the entire palace is like crumbling apart yeah. while they're like walking merrily? Well, out, like, out like out as of they're the like head. having this conversation, uh, the parasol like stalks into the room, uh, Krieg in yeah. hand, like the music. Yeah, the officer behind them. Yes, yeah, so Winter. Her, did sorry. you pick up the uh, the gun? Yeah. If no one else is taking it, the <laughs> officer will. Yeah. yeah nice. Uh, oh yeah, I was about to like say like no, and then I break her neck or something, and then I remembered. Oh wait, no, that's not Renee. Renee's dead. Yeah, Renee's dead <laughs> yeah, we don't need to give Renee more powerful objects. It seems that she rolls poorly when they're handed to her. Yeah, but, um, that's gonna <laughs> that really sucks. That one roll really like. <laughs> oh. Um, so so she storms into the room. Is she gonna like? point a thing at us or like uh, no she basically um no like she, she's holding Krieg in like a threatening manner but she's not like pointing at anyone specifically she's just pissed and she's like well, I mean to be honest Laura's dead so yeah no no like the, the particular <laughs> objects know, of her... I know but like all the yeah. traces of the uh of, of the uh units of the new unit is gone yeah, no. Like basically, like yeah, like the the new unit is broken and gone. Like she, at this point, she's pissed because her dad's dead. She's not pissed because yeah. of the new Worry, unit. Don't worry, like, parasol. I'll fix him. No, don't fix him. He's a tyrant. Um, she she just glares at you out. like the, 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 the officer turns around. With the, this, was, this was not said out loud. I did not say <laughs> that out loud. Okay, but yeah, she um, she, she like stalks in and is like. The child is. The child will live. Good. <clears throat> Doctor, I don't resurrect you, everyone. Don't you mean Patricia what do you want Maltese? Me to say? I, I, I can don't. resurrect one person every two minutes. <laughs> no, you, because here's the thing: you like the people have been dead for like Renee can't be resurrected because she's been she takes too much damage. No, Lord you can resurrect. Yeah, I don't. Marie. I don't care about Renee. I'm not going to help Laura. Laura took too much damage. Right. Yeah, no, I don't Laura care about was, Laura. I'm not going to help Laura her. I'm going to help the kids. Yeah. Laura was blown to pieces. Like, yeah. that's like, impossible. So, so basically, the only person you can really bring back is Marie. But you can't bring back Marie. What about the king? The king is the king, the king was smashed was and turned into a table. <laughs> like his body was mutilated beyond repair. How much damage was that? Let me tell you. Uh, that, 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 look, he, there he is took, the chunky salsa rule, yeah. and he was chunky salsa. He, he took minus. <laughs> he, he took about four hundred points of damage when his entire like his entire bone structure was splintered and reworked into a table. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yeah. But yeah, you you can bring back Marie. Yeah. Please. She's, yeah. she's no, just like a I've small decided child. to pass on her. Okay. You're, you're gonna let That's poor Marie really... die? I'm gonna let Marie die. Why? Wow. Who knows? Maybe there's a bit of abuse in her. There, there's no abuse okay. in her. <laughs> that so, so, um, okay. so you're gonna say that there's a little bit of abuse in her when Mabuse just snapped her neck and abandon her for a stronger host. 
and then was sucked into a skull heart. Yeah. <laughs> I don't so, know how these things work. I don't know how many points you Yes, has. you do. You knew enough to you knew enough to remove from abuse in the first place. You know exactly how this shit works. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, you you know enough to know that she's not infected. Yep. I mean, no, no. Well, but... <laughs> <laughs> well, no. yeah, maybe in I'm seven years actually... she would come back yeah. as a skull girl. <laughs> wow, zombie cam. Guess one. You probably just created another Skullgirl by doing that. Yeah, there's a, there's a good chance of that. Because I'm resurrecting her. My God, you people are too easy. No, 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 no. <laughs> I was, I was going to say, if you don't do it, I'm, that's fine. I'm just going to say the Peacock basically overhears you. I would stop decision. not resurrect her. Fine. Okay, right. okay, okay. So that's what we were asking you. Because your character's reasoning could be anything. Okay, so, so you, you do resurrect her. doctor. Yeah. Okay. Um, He's I, never killed Fate anyone is gonna in walk his way. To Parasol, and uh, essentially, symbolically, because it doesn't actually do anything. Um, he's going to offer her the um, the butt of his, the the butt of his spear in kind of a like, all right, I'm standing down and offering myself into your custody kind of manner. Yeah. She she looks down at you and then like basically taps the end of your spear and says, "Stand up, you fucking loser." Well, no, I didn't. I didn't actually get down on one knee. Okay, I was just like yeah, like you like offered like the spear like some. Well, she what, just how do you know like, she's not taller than you? Yeah. Okay, but she like she taps and is like like fine, like don't bother. All right. Get the hell out of my kingdom. I, you're not arrested. You're not. I'm not going to press charges. As far as the official record is concerned, none of this ever happened. Like you were never here. Like you were not involved in any way with the death of the king. Your relationship with the new unit is null and void, and we won't, you know, like follow you on those charges. But you know, like find somewhere else to live. I don't ever want to like hear from you in my kingdom ever again. Okay. He uh, goes, by the way, if you ever do need a bodyguard, you will be able to find me. She, she kind of just gives you a sidelong look and says, there's a train, like there's a train, uh, like sending, uh, that was supposed to be sending troops to the front lines against the chess kingdom. If you hurry, you might be able to reach it. I hear some friends of yours might be over in that area. I don't have friends, ma'am. <laughs> it's like, except for the dock, but that's the dock. She shrugs. <laughs> Whatever you want to do. Gigans, Chess Kingdom, Badlands, to stay out of the Canopy Kingdom. I go wherever the Skullheart does. Then I won't see you. It, have to hear from you again for seven years. Of course. The Doctor walks up to Parasol, and he says, "Parasol, if I may." Yes, Doctor. Doctor Perhaps. Doctor? That's not actually my name. Okay, okay. That's, Damn, that's... that's oh. Doctor Avian. <clears throat> uh, Doctor. You might consider the fact that this could work to your favor. How do you mean? Has there ever been a better reason for all of the other empires to unite against the Gigans? Wow. You're... <laughs> Asshole. Yeah, she, he, she looks at like the body of uh, of uh, you know Hippo, and her like her face hardens. She says, "No, like, the chess kingdom." Like when they find out who sent the uh, you know the uh, undead against us, they won't uh, like the war will end. After the losses we've faced on both, like both of our forces have, fa have uh, suffered from, 
at the hands of that creature. Jesus. Bigotry wins, everyone. <laughs> All I'm, I'm not it? saying necessarily all-out war again. I'm saying this could be a reason to tie closer relations to the chest kingdom at the expense of relations with the Gigans. I could see it. Oh my god, you're so much of an asshole. <laughs> what am I doing wrong? You're I'm trying to stop a war. Literally, like, the entire thing Laura has been saying the entire time is the bigotry and horrible shit that's uh, it's caused Laura. every schoolgirl. It's literally yeah. going oh, well, to yeah, be no, what you're it's basing secular. this decision it's on. It's secular. Like, if you stop the, like, you properly stopped the war and stuff, it might have even have, like, uh, stopped the rise of another schoolgirl. But nope, nope. Racism and bigotry continue. Okay, and she's like, racism ends. Yeah, she's like, yes. No, the uh, you know, the Eagle's Gigan... wish means nothing. <laughs> yeah, each, each time, like, well, no, it doesn't because what happens is the Gigans will be uh, like uh, put on like a like a on an equal footing. Uh, in that, the Gigans are going to basically like, uh, like. Here's the thing: the long-term implications of the wish. You're uh, really trying to pull something. No, 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 no. I'm just thinking and... about this. I'm thinking about this because the the exact wording of her wish was. <laughs> That the Gigans be put on the same level as the uh, humans in the city, which means that if they start getting mistreated and like the word like kind of goes on the other direction, there's only one way for the wish to like fulfill itself. The city is worse. <laughs> the city is worse. The city is worse, or the Gigans win this three-way war. Oh, the second part of that sounds fun. Yeah. So like, or, or the two unite. Or the Gaians win the three-way war. Man, right? no, I'm not finished. <laughs> they they unite. Uh, actually, no, Fade's going to speak up. Ma'am, if I may. U utilizing the, the strength of both armies as a threat to open negotiations with the Gaians might end the war completely. She, she's like, why are you still in my presence? Because, ma'am, like it or not, I will deal with the diplomatic I actually, negotiations. I do not require you your assistance. Do the wishes be here? What? Do the wishes play I out even after the death? Yes. Yes. Like, yes. yes. They, 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 the gods have gotten um, involved. Otherwise, Annie would not be immortal. Yeah. Well, no, but that takes place beforehand. Like, she becomes immortal before. No, her but otherwise, death. then. But, but, yeah, the, the witch would, would have, like, ended. Does the. The Medici don't keep, keep, keep die in mind. after. Well, that's the thing. Well, like, yeah, the, 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 killed. No, the, 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 because the Medici's are killed. Like, even in the ending, like basically the only ending where they're not explicitly is uh, during the uh, uh, is during the uh, like uh, uh, Cerebella ending, and they're like the, the direct wish was to uh, kill Lorenzo Medici, and it's implied that uh, uh, Vitelli had taken over the mob from his father. Who had supposed like assumedly died, and all yeah. the other endings. It was basically are... like take revenge <laughs> on the Medici, which means it's also Peacock facing off against. Yeah, Dahlia. Yeah, like, yeah but, but in that uh, one, that, that's implied that Peacock was going to kill Dahlia and or incapacitate Dahlia. And yeah, she was going to take out the mafia regardless. Yeah. Meaning, to die. Yeah, basically, it's fa like the way I'm interpreting this is fatalistic. That like these cycles inevitably play out and that the wishes do eventually come true because it's the goddess's power uh, granting them. Like, as long as the goddesses remain, the wish will eventually come to pass. Which means, if you want to keep the thing going, if you want to prevent it, kill the gods. Yep. Well, I was about to get to that. <laughs> <coughs> okay, yeah, where does... But, uh, uh, actually, actually, no... So, Fade, despite have, uh, earlier blunders, stepped in between the new queen and the rampaging Skullgirl to protect her. Yeah. We, so we, he's 
which is why offended. Yeah, which is why she's giving you like a full pardon for treasonous like actions in, against. Yeah. The, no, she's like, sending you, me into exile. Yeah, well, instead yeah, of yeah, having you executed. Treason. That's true. Like she, yeah. she's she's not executing you because like you know she respects the fact that you saved her life. Yeah. Um. But but it's like actually, ma'am, I'll be gone as soon as I compose myself. But because like it or not, like yes, he was healed from the damage. But it's not pleasant. So yeah. he's like, he's like, I'll be gone as soon as I compose myself. And I was only offering a suggestion. I suggest you take those if you're going to be the ruler that I hope you will be. I will run my kingdom in the best way possible to protect my people. I do not require the advice. I, I, I have trusted advisors alongside me and people who will undoubtedly continue to serve me in the years to come. She steps over next to Doc and... Uh, oh, like, God. He over. better not be a fucking advisor now. Like, <laughs> no. we, like we will, like, grow stronger through these dark times. And she, like, helps, uh, like, one of the egrets up who, uh, like, dusts himself off as, like, winter, your egret, like, kind of, like, steps in. And, like, the egrets yeah. are, like, four, like, like, uh, like filing in like slowly like carrying in wounded and uh, like bringing in stretchers and stuff and like as they do like Parasol uh, steps out in front of them and says the Canopy Kingdom will rise from the ashes of this dark day and become stronger for our losses along with the Chess Kingdom we will ensure that our people continue to live and thrive going into the next uh, you know into the next Seven years, and the seven years after that, and the seven years after that. We will not let the actions of anyone, Gigan or human or feral, tarnish our great city and our great nation. And my father's legacy will not disappear with, into the annals of history. The new oh. unit is gone. The Medici are gone. And as it always should have been, the royal family now controls all of New Meridian and the Canopy Kingdom. There will be peace in our time and there will be order. Oh. He, he, he just nods. He just nods and, you know, he, he's satisfied with the there will be peace because as long as that is the goal that is what he is you know so he, he just nods and after his bones reform which doesn't take long um yeah he uh he goes off into the city he doesn't actually leave the kingdom but he keeps his head down okay yeah. oh okay the problem is is Skullgirls 3 is not going to Probably not going to be. He's going to be mechanic. in the chess kingdom, probably. Yeah. <laughs> and then he'll no. just leave and go to the chess kingdom when he hears about that. Yeah. Yeah, probably. That's a good point. But, yeah. Just so leave like, at any point. But, the but basically, like, the way we'll kind of do this is a little cinematic thing, like, to, to just, like, end off where, like, this ends and uh, where the final campaign will take place eventually. Uh, you know, we kind of follow, like, along, like, across the battlefields where. Uh, like dead, uh, like skull oh, yeah. dragons. But okay, Doc's what else? Got to do his outro bit. Oh, okay, Jesus what, what, fucking Christ! You've already done your. Uh, what, okay, what is? No, it? I haven't. What's your Look, outro? I have. I can do like dozens. Okay, <laughs> this is not going to be Lord of the Rings. You get one. The doctor. Get one. The doctor walks up to a window and leans on it. Well, it looks like it's time to go. Plague hunting. I'm waking. And then he, then he moves onto like a balcony. And he like he like holds his arms out to the side like a roar, like a yeah triumphant. Yeah. And then he says, "Maybe my wife." And as much as it pains me to say this, oh, I'm like why does he sound young now? <laughs> as much as it pains me to say this, perhaps my wife could help us. She has been studying Skullgirls for the last few centuries that I've known her, at least. 
Oh my son, you sunk on You're that uh, old? Uh, yeah. <sighs> so we sweep out across the battlefields full of skeletons and dead people and all this stuff uh, to a caravan slowly crossing the, uh, like the newly open borders between uh, Canopy and Chess Kingdoms as uh, like a bunch of like trucks with uh, like worn and faded new unit logos uh, roll into the capital of the Chess Kingdom and uh, you know like uh, like uh, what the fuck's her name? Um, uh, um, your your character, um, Speakeasy. Speakeasy, yeah. Yeah, Speakeasy, like, steps out, like, opens up the doors and costs sign and uh, squiggly step out into the new city. Uh, and, like, basically like, start to set up shop. Like, the, start to, like, set up new routes for the new unit. Hey. Hey. Meanwhile, on the other, other part of town, Math- Mafia... Ayo. Yeah, there's there's no mafia in the chess kingdom right now. There's like a different criminal organization. What what I'm saying is eventually yeah. there'll be. Oh yeah, there's like yeah, new, new the uh, not yeah. cruiser. And actually, like you know, like, like actually, up, you know, it's like, the like, Montes like, like actually, no. Like what happens is like like over top you see like this blimp, uh, with like golden Egyptian like like lo- like designs like running up and down. It like floats in towards one of the taller buildings. <laughs> because she's not <laughs> fucking done with you people yet. Yeah. And uh, yeah, who isn't? Uh, Eliza. Oh, I was about to say, isn't she dead yet or something? No, like you guys failed uh, to kill her. You like beat the shit out of her, but um, she was almost dead. <laughs> yeah. I surfed her down a staircase. That doesn't mean shit when yeah, you're you... finding someone with a parasite. <laughs> Yeah, you, you basically serve someone almost as strong as a skull girl down a like a flight of stairs and like then ran away. She, anyway, she, she, was she should be scared of me. She oh, probably doesn't oh, want to come she, after me. She's, she's not coming after you. She's going after uh, the new unit. Why? Because they were the, like they were uh, like she thinks Mavius is still with them, and she hasn't done like. Just tell her. Things. Sorry, Eliza. Well, you can oh, do sorry. That in the I, I'm campaign. sorry. You'll be too busy yeah. helping racism continue. Yeah, spreading, spreading racism. I did nothing is racist. Evil. Is it racist to say that person is a fucking monster? Oh, no, 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 no. That's when not the way you worded are. it. That's not the way you worded it. You're saying you said, "Let's go after the um, kingdom of black people." In order to unite ourselves with the kingdom of Jewish people, the kingdom of other white let's, people. Let's let's have <laughs> let's have one war instead of two. Let's kill. Wait, wait, Jackies. hold on. Are you really oh. Point, oh. Po- pointing out That's the Dagons as a force said. of like, you know, an oppressed people when they yes, like then is the entire in, in they are an oppressed minority. Yeah. It, it actually a lot. It's a lot closer to say that they're basically Japanese. The Japanese people in America during World War Two, like they're then they should stay in their own country. Oh my fucking god, <laughs> Jesus! Oh, I'm like okay, anyway. So, so all I remember was all, all I remember hearing them. about it was a, was that there was a war with them. Um, they're, yeah, they're, so. they they very explicitly talk about like uh, racial tensions in uh, both Beowulf's campaign and. Uh, in one of the characters who wasn't in, uh, wasn't in added. In fact, to the that happened that same exact day that this happened. Yeah. The yeah. Uh, the thing that basically. Yeah, uh, there's like a big was used as propaganda. Yeah, there's like a big match between Beowulf and a guy that was basically like like racist wartime propaganda about like yeah, check out our cool you know, awesome basic, human beat up yeah. this savage evil guy Yeah, they that basically... actually works now because now we have like a real reason to hate them as well. No, they're... but they also but they drunk him up and they're like yeah kill him. Yeah. Kill this drunk dumb baby. Yeah. Well, they didn't actually tell him that. They just, like, push him in the ring and then let okay. him accidentally kill them. Yeah, but, but yeah, he wouldn't well. have gotten it anyways because he's an idiot. Yeah. But, like... Well, yeah, that's, that's the thing. He's an idiot. But, um... But no, the thing yeah, is, though, is they're, like, best friends now. Well, yeah, because... Because he keeps the, his arm. Yeah, because Beowulf didn't oh, realize he was going to hurt him. That's campaign. Yeah. Well, I am sorry, viewers, for having to sit through this. I'm so sorry we've been arguing for this entire time. No, oh, it's fun. It's a post-game, like, rambling. Yeah. Uh, well, fun. I've never played through Beowulf's storyline either, so oh, it was fun. like... Yeah. 
But anyway, yeah. So it's, we'll... it's basically the DJ Khaled, you played yourself thing. Yeah. yeah. Uh, um, but <laughs> no, it's it's great. And um, but anyway, so yeah. So in the in the third and final campaign, it will take place in the chess kingdom. We'll probably have an entirely new set of characters, uh, as I'm going to be using a different system for uh, the game. Um, but then, yeah, we're going to be kind of like picking up where we left off. Uh, seven years later uh, and finding out what happened to the new unit uh, now that they are sans both of the uh, like they are sans undertale shut up they're sans <laughs> two of their main leaders and are <laughs> and are uh, being hunted by one and like basically have been like completely outlawed by one nation which is now allied with their new home nation uh, and are being like pressured by uh eliza who is basically going to immediately start like setting up roots and trying to like we like just push them out of like territory Gun immediately weed them out. uh so oh. they're going to be kind of in a really really rough state like basically like the first game you started out building up from nothing but no one hated you second game you had everything but everyone hated you third game you <laughs> have nothing and everyone hates you well who Yay. says that everyone hates us what if we why does everyone it? hate us well, ever, Wait, ever, we're new people, though. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. Like, so you're, you're depends people, on who like, we make. You're, you're new people in a new city that is allied with people who have basically outlawed you as terrorists and revolutionaries. What do you mean they outlawed us as terrorists? Because we're we're ty- entirely new <laughs> characters. Right. Who says I'm so? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. So the new unit. Yeah. So anyway. Um, yeah. So anyway. Yeah. Yeah, if anyone has anything they want to add to finish out this uh, this campaign, we will... Uh... Um, I have one last word. Okay. One of them, them, them. Fantastic. <laughs> See you guys next time. <laughs> I could keep going all night. Let's keep going. We don't have any story. We don't have any. Okay, well, I'll let you have one more thing. What, what, what do you want to do? Fucking well, no, end the recording and I'll just talk about it here, guys. Oh, 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 yeah, okay. Well, in that case, once again, thank you very much for watching. We hope you join us uh, for the next campaign, which... Uh, what will that be, actually? Like, obviously, next week is uh, um, JoJo, but it's Major's Bizarre Pathfinder, isn't it? Oh my God! Is let's it let's just let, why don't, no? Why don't we just stick with? Shut up, Major. Please. Oh um, no! No, we are because going to have we'll Major next week, but the next session, like yeah, yeah look, the the one that replaces Skullgirls is is Major. And then it's no, it's not, God damn it! I don't want to do.